Hey, Ray Wiley Hubbard here, and uh, a lot of people come up and ask me about songwriting. Well, not a lot of people, a few people. I think there was one guy one time. And so, uh, asked me about kind of where the uh, inspiration and ideas come from. So, we're going to do this thing where uh, every week I'm going to pick a song that I've written and kind of talk about how it came about. And what better way to start this off than with the song Snake Farm. Okay, there's an old snake farm in New Braunfels, Texas, between Austin and San Antonio. It's been there about 40 years. And there's a, a rumor that it was something more than a snake farm, but I can't, I don't know about that. Doesn't make any difference. So anyhow, uh, I've driven by it probably 10,000 times. And so one day, I'm driving by, and all of a sudden I see the snake farm. And oh, wait a minute, I'm coming from Austin to San Antonio. So it's on my right, excuse me. So I see the snake farm there and I'm driving along and all of a sudden I just go, Phew. I go, God, just sounds nasty. I said, well, it is. It's not a church or a, a, a hospital. It's a reptile house. I'm like, God, snake farm. Man, it just sounds nasty. A snake farm, well, pretty much is. Snake farm, it's a reptile house, snake farm. Ooh. So anyhow, that was... I kept singing that in my head for some strange reason. And then I said, well, what am I going to do with this? And I said, well, I'll make it a love song. I'll make it about a man who doesn't like snakes, Ooh. but he's in love with a woman who works at the snake farm. So then you kind of start, well, what kind of woman would work at the a snake farm? Well, she would look like a young Tempest Storm. She'd dance like Little Egypt. She would drink malt liquor. She would have a tattoo with, that would be humorous, and uh, she would like the alarm. So anyhow, I just kind of put all that together, and I came back home, and I hit an E chord without the third, and then just got a groove.